Welcome, this is your Option Monster Volatility Sonar Report. From the floor of the SIBO, this is Jamie Tyrrell from Group 1 Trading. Well, it's been an exciting morning in VIX trading today after a huge rally uh, over the last three days of 10% with the banks and GE really leading the way back up. The market is basically unchanged today. So there were a lot of market observers who saw the VIX cash go out 41 yesterday. And on an unchanged day, they would have expected to come down a little bit more. But that's not what we're seeing at all. The VIX cash is up $2. Uh, the VIX futures are up about the same. And we're seeing some stickiness around that 40 level. And the VIX had a lot of trouble breaking through that. Uh, what we're seeing in option trading is people are predicting more and more for the VIX to stick around here. Option premiums have gone down a lot today, indicating that people are expecting less movement out of the VIX cash and VIX future into next Wednesday's print. So the at the money straddle right now is the March 42 and a half straddle. And that's trading for about 350. So people who are selling that straddle are betting that the VIX is going to finish in between 39 and 46, about the range it's been in for the past few days throughout the rally. Uh, <clears throat> so as we approach expiration, a lot of premium coming down, not just the at the money straddle, but upside and downside. The March 37 puts are trading 15 cents. March 35 puts are trading a nickel. So more and more of our customers are saying that they're expecting the VIX to sit still. Again, nobody knows what's going to happen or where things are going to go. I uh, wanted to touch on a big trade from yesterday. It was it involved 40,000 VIX contracts, and it was a complicated spread order. Uh, what the customer did was bought 10,000 April 40s, and then they sold 10,000 April 50s, 10,000 April 60s, all calls on those, buying the 40 calls, selling the 50s, selling the 60s, and then also selling the April 35 puts. Uh, so the, the strategy is, uh, is basically a bet that the VIX is going to finish between 40 and 60 in April, our next bet out, or our next month out. Uh, they paid between 80 cents and a dollar. So anywhere between 35 and 40, they'd lose that premium. Uh, anywhere above 60, they'd start really losing money on the trade. But between 40 and 60 is their sweet spot. Uh, and they can make up to $9 if the VIX finishes 50. Uh, so that was the trade we had a customer making that the VIX is going to continue to stay high. Uh, you know, there's always contrary trades and there's always people willing to sell that. So that went up 40,000 times. Somebody betting on a print in between 40 and 60. Others saying no, they don't think that's where it's going to go and selling that. Uh, so that's what we got going here. Check back for more. Next week is expiration week. So two days of March trading to go and then the print on Wednesday. Jamie Tyrrell with Option Monster.